हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द स्टेनो सक्सेस क्लासेज शॉर्ट हैंड डिक्टेशन एट द स्पीड ऑफ सिक्सटी वर्ड्स पर मिनट ट्रांसक्रिप्शन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव पार्ट टू स्टार्ट इफ वी टेक इन टू कंसिड्रेशन द एफिलेटेड कॉलेज वी विल नोटिस दैट द टीचर्स आर सब्जेक्टेड टू सच ह्यूमिलेटिंग कंडीशन दैट इट इज नॉट possible for them to discharge their duties to their students to impart to their students any sense of responsibility or any moral values in their lives i therefore sir feel that it is necessary to be more careful about the preservation of academic freedom to teachers para sir we are grateful to the education ministry and to the university grants commission for upgrading the salaries of teachers in the central universities yet a great disparity prevails in the salaries of teachers of central universities and state universities and affiliated colleges and this disparity is causing a lot of heart burning and a lot of difficulties as one connected with education i may say that there is not such a marked difference in the quality of teachers serving in the central universities and in the city universities and in affiliated colleges as to justify the great disparity in the salaries of teachers of these institutions i feel sir that we must keep in our mind the remarks of the university grants commission made in their earlier annual report with regard to teachers salaries we are not only to provide adequate salaries to teachers of affiliated colleges but also to teachers of secondary schools we must remember sir that a great majority of students study in affiliated colleges and the quality of education is largely determined by the quality of work that is done in affiliated colleges para for improvement in the quality of teaching improvement in living conditions is also very necessary the university grants commission has to admit that it does not seem likely that we shall be able to make anything more than the marginal contribution towards this practical need i feel that the university grants commission should pay more attention to the solution of this problem then has so 
for being paid by it and the education ministry and that the government should not grudge funds to the university grants commission for making advocate arrangements for improving living conditions of teachers who are expected to train the citizens of the country sir in the university grants commission report it is maintained that rupees 12000 should be granted to every affiliated college for the welfare of the teaching staff and that efforts should be made to provide them with quarters and that too in the vicinity of the college where they teach stop